we discussed many aspects of God. Let us spend time in experiencing God Himself. How can I see God? How to reach God? How to converse with God? These are perhaps the basic questions over which people keep thinking deeply. Having a momentary glimpse of God remains the noblest wish of many. God is incorporeal and subtle. It is not possible to see Him with physical eyes, the way we see other human beings. Similarly, it is not possible to hear or talk to Him the way we do with others. So, it is not wise to expect to meet, see or talk to God in this physical way. God says, Remember me to reach me. The way to reach God is to remember Him. God is very sweet and loving. His sweetness and love can be experienced by remembering Him with lot of love. As much as one remembers God intensely, one starts to understand the Self, experience Him, and experience all that He bestows. One will realize not only their relationship with Him, but their duty towards humanity as well. Remembering God is synonymous with receiving all the qualities and abilities He has. One will experience peace and happiness. One will get solutions for all the problems they are facing and become free from bondage. The mind gets strengthened to such an extent that one can handle any situation one is facing with confidence. Good intentions and pure wishes get fulfilled. The method to remember Him is simple and easy. There is no need of any via media. Every human being has their own limitation in understanding God. So, one need not depend on any other human being to get connected to God. An effort has to be made to mentally withdraw from the feelings of the surroundings and the body. Voluntarily and consciously bring back the awareness that I am a soul and I am seated between the two eyebrows in the forehead. Then in this state of mind, remember God as a point of light. Slowly create thoughts of His divine attributes, the ocean of knowledge, ocean of peace, ocean of happiness, ocean of bliss, and ocean of all powers. Think of all aspects of God. Keep thinking of all relationships with Him, like father, mother, teacher, and so on. Rediscover every relationship with Him. Have thoughts of His personality and glorification. Think of how I, the soul, am a sentient being, different from the body. Be in this awareness as much as possible. Keep doing this time and again till it becomes natural. The way to win over God and make Him mine is to become honest with Him. One should make oneself completely transparent to God to receive His unmatched love and powers. Anyone who wishes to transform or reform one's own self and thereby contribute towards world peace automatically stands qualified to get all help from God. Those who take just one step of courage and determination in this direction of righteousness 
certainly receive a thousandfold help from God. However, it is we, the human beings, who have to take the first step. God's help just flows. This also indicates the enormity of His grace, which makes the otherwise arduous path easy. Anyone can certainly experience the nearness of God. His proximity, which can be felt and experienced, is much more than that of any human being. It is then that we realize the true goal and purpose of our life, which is self-realization and God-realization, and help others discover the path of realization.